Hello grade 9. I will continue explaining uh, hydrocarbons. Now we will talk about one of the unsaturated hydrocarbons which is the alkene. Let's start. First, the definition of alkenes. Alkenes are unsaturated hydrocarbons. Why they are unsaturated? Due to the presence of a double covalent bond between two carbon atoms. The general molecular formula of an alkane is CnH2n. The first alkene start by two carbon, n equal two. The two alkenes that we are concerned with this year are only ethene and propene. First alkene and uh, second alkene. Here we have the molecular formula, structural formula, and condensed structural formula of the first two alkenes. First alkene is called ethene or ethylene. Its molecular formula is C2H4. Here we have the structural formula. You see the presence of a double bond and the condensed structural formula. And the second alkene, which is the propene, its molecular formula is C3H6. Here we have the structural formula. This is the double bond. We can put it here or here. It's the same. And here is the condensed structural formula. Now, which of the hydrocarbons is considered as an isomer for an alkene? As we said before, that isomers are hydrocarbons having same molecular formula but different structural formula or condensed structural formula. So, the isomer of an alkene is a cycloalkane having the same molecular formula CnH2n. For example, propene having the molecular formula C3H6 C3H6 could be written in the form of protein or cyclopropane. So both of them are isomer. Here all the bonds are single covalent bonds. However, here we have a double bond. Here we have a cycle. Here we have open chain. Okay. Now reactions of alkenes. Alkenes undergo two kinds of reactions either the combustion reaction or addition reaction in addition reaction we will talk about only the ethene the reactions of ethene now combustion of alkenes as we said a combustion reaction is a reaction with oxygen as we have so in the alkane the general equation of the combustion of an alkene is CnH2n, which is the general molecular formula of an alkene, plus 3n over 2 oxygen gives NCO2 plus NH2O, and beside the heat energy released. Let us have an example. If we have n equal 2, so the alkene is C2H4, it will react with 3O2 to give 2CO2 plus 2H2O. In the addition reaction, we will talk about the reactions of ethene. For more information, ethene uh, is present as a gaseous hormone in some fruits and vegetables in order to ripen uh, these fruits and vegetables. Now the reactivity of ethene. Unlike alkanes, alkenes like ethene are highly reactive due to the presence of highly reactive side which is the double bond. So alkenes are reactive and undergo addition reactions because of the presence of a double bond. As you are seeing here, uh, the double bond is an unsaturated side so it makes the alkene molecule highly reactive reaction occurs 
by a specific mecha mechanism that we will observe. For this reason, ethene undergo addition reactions where the double bond breaks down into single covalent bond and the new atoms are added to the hydrocarbon structure. Here we have an ethene molecule. What happens when ethene undergoes an addition reaction? When any molecule X2 Okay, I write X for any kind of atoms. Approach into an ethene. The unsaturated site, which is the double bond, will break down. So, this leads for one of the atoms of the another molecule to bond into the molecule of ethene. And the second one will bond into the second carbon as you are seeing here all the bonds will be single covalent bond the molecule will be saturated by adding two new atoms okay what are these atoms let us see the types of addition reactions first kind of reaction is hydrogenation reaction. Hydrogenation reaction is a reaction with a hydrogen, H2, in the presence of a catalyst, which is nickel, and under the effect of heat. Here we have ethene, CH2, double bond CH2, plus H2 will give CH3, CH3. How? By this mechanism. The first hydrogen will go to the first carbon atom after breaking the double bond as we have seen in the mechanism and the second hydrogen will bond to the second carbon atom to get CH3 CH3 which is ethane a saturated hydrocarbon so from ethene we can get ethane by adding hydrogen here we have the condensed structural formula and we can write the, uh, the structural formula. We can write using condensed structural formula or using the structural formula. Okay, same mechanism. Second kind of reactions, of addition reactions, is the halogenation. Halogenation is by addition of a halogen, which are either chlorine or bromine. First, we'll deal with chlorine. It is called chlorination. What happens? Ethene, CH2, double bond CH2, will react with Cl2. This means that first Cl will go to the first carbon atom, as you are seeing, after breaking the double bond, and the second Cl will bond to the second carbon atom in order to get CH2. Cl single bond CH2 Cl which is a saturated hydrocarbon. The condensed structural formula, the reaction using condensed structural formula as you are seeing or using the structural formula. We can write both ways. Uh, second kind is the bromination, addition of bromine, same mechanism. We are changing the atoms but we are making the same mechanism. Also, first Br, first bromine, will bond to the first carbon atom. After breaking the double bond, second Br will bond to the second carbon atom to get CH2Br, CH2Br, and single bond between the two carbon atoms. Also, I will show you the reaction using condensed structural formula or using the structural formula okay the name of an haloalkane is not needed third type of addition reactions is the addition of hydrochloric acid hcl also same mechanism here we have ethene CH2 double bond CH2. The double bond will break. The hydrogen will bond to the first carbon atom 
and the chlorine will bond to the second carbon atom in order to get CH3, CH2, Cl, okay, which is a saturated hydrocarbon. Here we have the condensed structural formula and this is the structural formula. The final addition reaction is hydration. Hydration is an addition of water molecule. Ethene, when react with water, the double bond will break. Hydrogen will go to the first carbon atom and OH will go to the second carbon atom to get CH3 single bond CH2H which is an alcohol also the name is not needed this is the content structural formula and this is the structural formula the equation using structural formula I'm giving both type of equation either by condensed structural formula or by using structural formula because according to that question sometimes we ask you to write using condensed structural formula sometimes we ask you to write using structural formula you have to pay attention to that question this is everything about alkenes thank you for listening and keep safe